I don't even feel like it's accurate to talk about we're coming out of the pandemic. I feel like we just did that for 18 months. 2021, we transacted the equivalent of like a year and a half in one year's time. What's interesting to me is that the office occupancy rate is at 40%. Knowing that there's so much virtual work still, people still wanted to be in New York. In late May, we started taking a pause, which felt very slow compared to the previous 18 months, but we really just entered a normal seasonal market, very similar to what we had in the summers of 2018 and 2019. So I don't think we can even compare what's happening right now to 2021, because 2021 was a complete anomaly. 2021 and the first half of 2022 has been all about luxury. In the second half of 2021, we saw several new development projects on the Upper East Side, all of them west of Third. I think the Upper East Side saw an example of, if you build it, they will come. <laughs> 150 East 78th Street, the Benson at Madison and 79th, the Belmont at Madison and 86th, 200 East 83rd Street, which is on 3rd Avenue. All of these buildings sold out. 109 East 79th is just off Park on 79th Street, surrounded by co-ops. So you're still in the co-op neighborhood, but you have this new beautiful product and that resonated with a lot of buyers. Where is the market going? That's what everybody wants to know. What's happening in the market? We're moving from what has been a very reactive market to now a responsive market. We had a sprint that lasted like the length of a marathon for 18 months. So there's been a lot of action and now there's a pause. If you're a buyer, I think you're feeling pretty good. So it feels like you might have an opportunity to have some negotiability, some extra inventory to look at. I think that if you're a seller, you have to understand that the market has changed from five months ago. You're not gonna get the same price that your neighbor got today, but Inventory levels might be rising a little bit, but there's still not a lot of quality inventory. So if you really are in that category of have to sell, there are plenty of buyers looking. They're just taking a little bit more time. 